I'm John Kiley. I'm an artist from Seattle, Washington. I've uh, been blowing glass for, oh, I think it's about 25 years now. Started right out of high school. And uh, the work I make is, um, the architecture for it is essentially joining sections together. So I'm really interested in this um, concept of connection and separation. So I'll take two separate pieces and fuse them together in the glass blind process. And then in my studio, uh, remove sections through grinding and polishing and using saws. So there's really two processes to my work. There's the glass blowing process, which involves a large team of about eight people working in two separate halves uh, to make one piece. And then there's the finishing process, which is the more involved process of making my work. So after the piece is blown and annealed, which is a cooling process after the um, work is blown, I bring them back to the studio uh, and the first thing that I do is I cover the piece with black electrical tape. And this does a couple of things. One is it prevents it from getting scratched in the grinding and polishing process. And the second thing that it does is it creates just a form that I can work with as a sculptor. So the black tape removes any uh, nuances of color or anything that might uh, affect decisions with the final form. So really the blowing process for me is about making blanks. And then um, afterwards is when the, the piece comes to life through being sculpted. So glass blowing is um, done usually in teams. Uh, my team is back in Seattle is particularly large, usually seven or eight people on it. And part of that is because it's a complex process to make the work and you need a big skilled team um, to achieve the piece. And the other part of having enough people is to really kind of take the mental load off of what you're doing. Um, there's a lot of decisions that have to be made on the fly when you're blowing glass. Uh, color, form, shape, temperature, um, that's a constantly changing thing. So you have to be able to adjust. And if there's too many other things to focus on, for instance, having to get up off the bench to open a door to a furnace, uh, it's harder to focus for me. Yeah, so when you watch a team of really skilled glass blowers, um, people often describe it as a dance, and it's definitely uh, a team activity. Everybody has to work together, and uh, we all kind of speak the same language. So, for instance, today some of the people on the team I've never worked with before, um, we all know what we're doing and work together to achieve the piece. Go to my website, johnkiley.com, and there's uh, galleries on that.